Okay, so what we're going to do is we'll just pull around and I'll just turn it on like we're going to a call. Alright. So what normally happens is like, we'll just put it on the hands free All right. and then I operate it from up here, but it's going to go through the same things. Like if I were just going to be using the, the siren, you know, it's using that and it's just putting it out in a lower, yeah. in a lower uh, decibel. Oh. Okay, so now when I turn it on... And you can kind of feel it in the floorboard. Yeah. But it's not really all that loud in here, you know? Yeah. Okay. Just the regular siren. And also, these are the rumblers, what we've been operating with. And these are my favorite things on this. There's in the, and these are the lights, and the there's wheels. the main wheel and speaker. Like, you know what that is, and that, this is the battalion chief, my favorite unit of the fire district. And I'm so glad that, um, that we got this unit. I'll show you what it looks like. Alright. And then this is the data where, and this is a mark, what, wider drew marker board. Let's see if we can take this and we can bring it out like this. Yes. Yeah. Oh, awesome. We're on a hill. Oh, yes. <laughs> This is all the notebooks and the documents of being the battalion chief. And it, it is a hard, I heard, I, I heard when I was talking with the battalion chief, sorry, I heard that um, it's, it, it, you have to be a um, firefighter first to become the battalion chief. Just like, like we can work off the back here, we got yeah. you know, all of our stuff here, got it, the radios here, and then we can also, we've got things like, we could actually take this out and it's, we can set up a command post in a, yeah. in a local spot. We've got another work spot where, like, another officer can come up and, uh, yeah. and so they can use this. Look, is it like a, a marker board? It's a marker board and magnetic. All right, that's so cool. They can work there. Yes. And how long? How long does it like? You have to be like a firefighter first to be the one of the battalion well, you chiefs. You have to be a firefighter first. You have to become a lieutenant. Then you have to go from there to captain then the captains are allowed to test to become battalion chiefs and uh, like the three battalion chiefs that we have uh, all three of us have been working for the fire department for about 30 years oh yes yeah. so you heard that on youtubers that you have to be have experience just be like it's just like um, being coming like you guys who want to be like the to be the chief of something you have to first start at uh, something very small like all jobs require then you get to be the role model, like, to tell everyone around. That is just how life rolls. And this is the fire exchanger, extinguisher, for just for a, a backup. And these are the computer network for the radios. And that, um, this is the, to become a battalion chief if you're inter interested. And that, um... So, yeah, we can, uh, you know, we run our command package off the back of here. And we can kind of come back here if I need to. I can check the... My mouse here. Let me show you the radios.
That's a cool piece of equipment. It's got the air, like we can fill the air cylinders on our on our packs and our air packs. Oh wow, that's it awesome. Extra cylinders. Yeah. It carries things like you know cords and ice yeah. and stuff like that and coolers. It's got a generator on it. Awesome. More coolers. So like if we get a call or we're gonna be there for a while, eventually like a uh, a structure fire or something, we'll have this yeah. come out to the scene. It can redo all of our air packs oh, wow. and stuff. Yeah. And then we got tents on here and chairs yeah. awesome. and. This is one of those uh, coolers, you see it like a, yeah. at a football game where they're oh, blowing yeah. uh, cool water on you and stuff. Yes. And then that's just the cascade system. So it, this awesome. is really just kind of a pickup truck on steroids. Yes. What is like, does this um, vehicle have like a different siren from the um, other units? It's got the same as the ambulances. Oh, uh, it does? Yeah. Uh. So it's, you know, the only, the only trucks, the only types of sirens we have are we have the regular like we have on all the ambulances yes. are on here and on the other staff cars yes then you've got the federal cues that are on all the engines and the trucks yes yeah the ladder trucks and stuff and then we have that rumbler which is on that truck right there that's the yeah. only truck that has a rumbler oh it's like um like all the um sirens sound the same but with the battalion chief it has the rumbler yeah, added the battalion to chief is the only one that has that Oh wow, awesome. Have this one responded to okay. any calls? You know, I think, yeah, it's responded to a couple of calls, but uh, uh. it doesn't, it doesn't get used that, you know, as yeah. much as, say, you know, something like that. Here's yeah. the speaker we on. Yeah, if we, um, I know there's been a couple of calls I've called for it to come out to, and usually somebody off duty will yeah. come and get it, uh, or or else we'll have if engine seven isn't out on a call, we'll tell yeah. them to come and bring it to the scene. Oh, uh, like this is one of the engines, and uh, one with the ladder trucks. Those are the ladder trucks. Well, we have the we have two of the uh, tillers. Yes, tiller trucks. Yeah, and I and thought you only had the newer what, tiller. Well, we have that one, and then the the old truck six is now the backup. Yes. Um, that truck is uh, up at headquarters. I have that. Oh.